Welcome back to Queens for the Night. It's time for another celebrity to tackle another drag discipline. He's been training hard with mentor Astina Mandela. It's fitness icon, Mr. Motivator. My name is Derek Evans. Push your hands right across. Everybody knows me as Mr. Motivator. Yes, yes, yes. I've not seen lots of drag, and so this is my first real experience. I think sometimes it's good to get out of your comfort zone and do something which is kind of totally different. Who is my drag mentor? What do they look like? Are they fun like me? Hi. I'm Astina Mandela, and I'm best known for dancing and giving you lip sync performances. Mr. Motivator, you may be the king of fitness, but I am going to turn you into a queen. Ow! goodness she's on fire are you ready i want you to release this inner me because i'm 70 this year you are seven yes i am seven zero yes seven zero he's incredible it's like me and my uncle to be honest with you i think what's really good is that we're both caribbean there's an understanding it's just going to be fun i think we're going to have a really good partnership what's the like drag identity coming from i've got to have a big front i want the backside so we're going booty really moving that body <laughs> Your drag talent is going to be lip syncing to one of the biggest icons of all time. Yes. Chef. No. Dang. Yes. Come on. <laughs> I. I. That sounds handsome. I don't think he realizes how difficult lip syncing is. Oh. Come on, child. Oh. There we go. Play the song. <laughs> Well, it's going to be tough. I want to get mm. to know you a bit more. D did you have the difficulty of identity whilst you were at school? I just knew I was not like the other boys. I was much more like the girls. I never understood how I'm meant to navigate the world as a black person who's queer and gay. Mm. The scene is someone who I just got to play as just my happiest self. Mr. Motivator's drag name has come into fruition. I'm thinking Proteina Turner. Proteina, yeah. I want to introduce Proteina Turner. Ooh. Once he starts dancing, he forgets lip sync. Once he starts lip syncing, he forgets the movement and choreo. I've done lots and lots of things in my career. And this is probably the most challenging thing I've ever done. I've had to learn to dance, lip sync. Oh! So many things could go wrong. I think I'm going to be nervous. Please welcome Mr. Motivator as his drag queen alter ego, Tina Turner.
Amazing. Oh, my. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to stay as Tina forever. <laughs> <laughs> that was incredible, incredible. I know your daughter is here and has got very emotional. You know what? I'm having the time of my life. You know, when you step out of your comfort zone and do something that you've never done, and then you get the support of someone like, hey, come on, Estina, <laughs> she's great. I mean, it's just wonderful. And at the end of the day, we tend to judge people, don't we? But until you've walked in their shoes, you don't know what something's like. And for me, at my wonderful age of nearly 70, doing this right is just oh, really tough. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I say, be stupid, be crazy, be weird, be whatever, because life is too short yeah. to be anything but happy. He has been the biggest blessing, and I'm honored to have been his drag mentor. What is it? But let's hear from our judges. Work me. Lip syncing is tough. It's not just moving your mouth to the words. You've got to think about the beginning of the word, the end of the word, the breath that the artist is taking, and they're all of the things that make it believable and, and transport you. And you transported me. It was just wonderful. I loved watching you perform. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Leighton, lip syncing, lots to think about, isn't there? Well, it didn't look like there was lots to think about because you came out there and slayed the house down. But <laughs> honestly, I was just so taken aback. Like, no shade here, but like, you're literally older than my granddad. And my granddad would not be able to do that. <laughs> and seeing two beautiful black queens up there as well doing your thing. It's just, yeah. It's just so much. yeah. yeah. I'm a queen, Lorraine. Did you hear that? And Tina Turner, the wig, the reveals, the choreo, the props. You know, I think it is so important in life to keep pushing yourself and you show you can do that at any age. Thank Absolutely. You. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. Rob, look, I don't know if I'm getting caught up in this, but I think that's the best thing I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. That's great. Yeah. It's so good, the core strength you've got to keep the wig on, unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been more motivated in my life. <laughs> uh, but I just thought it was, it was so joyous to watch. You came out, you loved it. When I did drag, I did the lip syncing and the dancing, and it was a nightmare. I went out, forgot it all. But you now the dancing and the lip syncing. It was great. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gorgeous comments, Protina. Oh, super comments. It just proves that the judges have got good taste. <laughs> Tina Mandela and Protina Turner. <laughs> After the break, England rugby star Joe Marler, as you have never seen him before, I guarantee you that. See you in a minute.